So let's have a case study here. I'll give you a second to read it. You can pause if you wish. Main things here, patient with sickle cell anemia, extremely tired, hematocrit dropped severely, reticulocyte index is low. Wow, that's very strange. Why sickle cell anemia patients are supposed to have high reticulocyte index. So what happened? Maybe the factory that it is producing reticulocytes is damaged. You mean the bone marrow? Absolutely. White blood cells and platelets are within normal range. So it's pure. Okay. Only red blood cells are affected. Red cell aplasia. Most probably due to parvo B19. Why do you say parvo B19? Why not any other cause? Because there is sickle cell anemia. Parvo B19 is notorious in causing transient aplastic anemia if the patient previously had sickle cell anemia. So parvo B19, that's the most likely diagnosis. What's the most um, accurate diagnostic test? Most accurate test is PCR for DNA. How to treat this parvo B19? 